Welcome back everyone. So breast cancer impacts one in every eight American women. Researchers are constantly searching for new ways to diagnose and then treat this all too common disease. The good news though, there are some pretty recent breakthroughs in breast cancer care. I win. Well played. Kristen Lyons was only 39 when she noticed a suspicious oh, lump in her breast. I just, I felt something and I thought, huh, it was real tiny, but it just felt different. It was breast cancer. Okay. It was about Tic Tac sized. It was very tiny, um, very treatable, and uh, hadn't spread into the lymph nodes or anything like that. Researchers are working hard to ensure that other women have a positive outcome like Kristen. One of the latest breakthroughs is a drug called Trodelphi. It was approved for patients with metastatic triple negative breast cancer, a type of breast cancer that usually is very hard to treat. Several new treatments for HER2 positive breast cancer that have also gained approval in just the last two years in HER2, Norlinx, Takiza, and Pezco. Liquid biopsy is another recent breakthrough that's made a difference in breast cancer care. It's essentially a blood test that detects the presence of cancer. In a study from Memorial Sloan Kettering in New York, researchers used the test in women with estrogen receptive positive metastatic breast cancer to successfully identify gene mutations yeah, and tailor treatments. It. These are breakthroughs that could help more women beat this deadly disease. The more we know, right? So an artificial intelligence algorithm is also helping doctors identify breast cancer on mammograms. In a study from Sweden, the AI technique was better at detecting breast cancer than six radiologists when they paired them against each other. But here's the thing, when you pair radiologists with this AI, the results were even better.